Happy Sunday. Yes, we are so excited to share something fun with you guys today. We got a delivery in the mail a couple of weeks ago yes. from Love Every. Mm -hmm. They're a toy company. They sent James a box and Teddy a box of really cool Specific toys. Specific to their age. Yes. Um, and so they arrived and we were super excited. <laughs> by experts for your child's developing brain. <laughs> what a special delivery. Love Every reached out to us and asked if they could send the boys some play kits. Ooh. Wow, look at that. And I think I think James is gonna get right to playing. <gasps> this has got a hammer feature. He's gonna love that. All right, there's a lot of toys, so we're not gonna show every single one right now. And we want them to like figure out which ones they really like and everything and also learn how to use them. So these are age appropriate toys like for their month grouping. And this is a fun one where like there's different, yes, good job. This, like you match up the colors and then so it's like mind and matching and was it motor skills there, hammering them in. We have now had the time to play with the toys and enjoy them, but today we get to share with you guys very more cool. more about them. Yeah. Very, very cool. We got sent some awesome toys from Love Every for James and for Teddy. And what's super cool about these is that they're what age specific. These? So we're gonna play with James this set, which is called James <laughs> Investigator. Can you say please? Wait, you look, these are all the toys that came in this set. Oh, We've been playing with this toy and we love it. Wow. And these give me like, speech therapy vibes. Yeah, I mean, this will be great for him. Bean bags. And another really cool thing, each box comes with this really nice, like walkthrough of each of the toys. And I will, you know, read through all of this, but it is so intentional and nice. like has great insight to children's development. This is this is only like half of what I've gone through. And so not only does it have like the insight to get into your little one's brain, it also tells you how you can use the toys and not in just one way either. Um, which honestly, like it is really nice to have this little boost of information, boost of confidence. It really is so nice. Like maybe like if you're having a lull with the toys that you have at home, like, I don't know, it's just really nice to have this little boost, a little inspiration. Um, and it's like designed so nicely. It's the paper, I love the, the, yeah, the font choice, the color, the yeah. And everything. Mm -hmm. Jamesy over here matching these colors. Wow! I like this one a lot because Fabulous. it comes with it. I like this one a lot because it comes with different setups. This one's this one's difficult. Mm -hmm. like this one's set up. Yeah. Whoa. So Teddy woke up from his nap, so he's gonna play with his. His is called the thinker so like we said we did get these boxes a couple of weeks ago so some of this is a little bit loved already um but that's all right so this is the the outline of what comes in teddy's box the thinker and it even gives a little timeline of like what they think like how they think you could introduce the toys again just like so thoughtful and so like easy to open up and like not be overwhelmed by all of the the fun toys. Wow, you got your book. What does the cow say? Moo. Wow. Wow. And just like Jamesy's, it has a full booklet of just explanations of development and 
advice. Give yourself time to reflect on all the reasons you're a great parent. Like, it's just so, so lovely. And it's like, there's tips beyond just the toys too. Just ideas for like other ways to play. So nice. So insightful. Even having two kids, like this is so nice for like a little burst of inspiration. Get the other piece, quick. Wow, put it in. Oh. Oh, you, you got the hang of that, huh? Go show mom. Oh, you're gonna put that there? Thank you. Do you wanna put these in here? Almost. You gotta turn it like this. Yay! To trick you up, we'll teach you how to use the lock. Teddy, you are a scholar. Oh, nice spinning. This little book of envelopes is super cute. Notes to my child, letters for a future you. Gosh. And although our main focus is Jamesy's speech, he is, um, he's learning to get used to being around other people. He's still quite reserved and he might just be an introvert, but just definitely like still a very like stranger danger sense to him. He's two and a half. Um, however, when, you know, our friend from Early Steps comes to play, sometimes he's a little apprehensive about playing with her. And so a lot of times, we are just observed. And so these toys will be great for us to like bring out to know that like he will be engaged with them. He gets excited, obviously, like he, he's been enjoying them. Um, and that we can bring them out and that we can be observed and we can like have that special time where they can really see him thrive. Because these toys really do showcase his skills so well, it'll be great. It'll be, it's it's just an, a great addition to to our house. Can you put this ball in the hole? Yay! Watch, I'm gonna go like this. You wanna wipe your hands? Look up, we slide, oh, there it is. And we can put it in here. Yay! And then we slide this. Yay! Who takes care of animals when they're sick? 
when you're just vibing on a Sunday, chill style. Got a little apple action, hanging out with your dad. Got Miss Rachel going. Living my best self, right, Teddy? Can really call the Mario Brothers. Alrighty, we got Mario on, and before we go to Magic Kingdom for the night, we're gonna eat some dinner. I made some creamy lemon orzo, just kind of like simple but tasty. And then I air fried up some zucchini with breadcrumbs and that this little Traeger veggie rub. Been using it in the air fryer all the time. So good. Made a little garlic aioli to dip those in with some pepper. And then some bruschetta and little bagel crisps with cream cheese. It's a little rainy. Going to Disney World. Use the pound on the ceiling and scream when we entered the property. Oh, they're sleepy. Oh, it's gonna scare them. <laughs> wow, you're so responsible. You're, you're so responsible. I want to scream when you were doing the shot. <laughs> we're going to Magic Kingdom. We're also meeting up with Florida's newest residents. We got the train welcoming us in. Oh, it's foggy. <laughs> Gloomy day in the park. Before, while Disney World cast members have always been the heart of our magic, these statues of Mickey and Minnie are dedicated to celebrate cast members, past, present, and future. Thank you for making Walt Disney's wow. dream a reality. Dedicated this 15th day of September 2021. That's us. We were past cast members. It says past, present, and future. Just you know, checking out our pals Goofy and Pluto. What is that? A dog! Two dogs. One wears pants and one doesn't. Doesn't say like adorbs with uh, ears on. Wow. She doesn't always rock the ears because they give her headaches. I don't last time I wore ears. But today Who it knows? is. Goofy! Jamesy, where do you want to go next? No big deal. Just my babe holding my hand through the Magic Kingdom. I'm like, it's just a Sunday. Living our best life. Wow. Put your hands through the sides. Oh no! <laughs> what are you in trouble for? Oh, hey! You heard that right? The Sicards have moved to Florida. Can you believe it? Because I cannot. And we're starting a vlog. <laughs> now that you're here, I believe it. Somebody left a flower on Leota's grave. One was also on Master Gracie's grave.
may be wondering why on earth the Sicards moved here. It's not actually because of us, and I don't even know if it's going to be forever. But this man right here got a nice job opportunity down here that they just couldn't pass up. So that's actually why they moved down here. And it was all very sudden. Like, we didn't know this a month and a half ago. I got the job in June. <laughs> Did you get the job in June? Yeah. Yeah. And that like, wasn't long ago. You were already no. selling the house. Yeah. It they, was just... Yeah. Snowballed. It kind of was like, oh, the house didn't sell yet. This job opportunity came up because they could have sold the Chicago house, bought a separate Chicago house, and they would have been like, yeah, we're not doing that job opportunity. So it's kind of a great opportunity for Grant to pursue. Uh, hopefully he doesn't get hopefully he doesn't get fired. And uh, if I get fired, I got annual passes out of it. There you go, and they're here now. So <laughs> get ready. I got babies with me now. I got a Poppy and a Teddy. The rest of the family are taking the bigger kids on Barnstorm right now. 10 minute wait, pretty solid. So I'm just strong with the babes. Jamesy, we are trying out Barnstormer again. This time with Mama. I missed them. I wanted to see James's reaction because this last time when I was on with him, it was his, la it was his first time ever on a roller coaster. So he's kind of like, I was wondering if he was going to be more jazzed. This time, let me grab the stroller. James, you have fun, dude? Yeah, I, of course. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. I didn't. The one with the I did not film at all. I was very. <laughs> I think I was more nervous than Jamesy. I held him tight. But he really, he really liked it that time. Much more sure second time around. A little more familiar. Did you like it? Are you proud of yourself? A little pit stop before the ride. You like that car? All right, we're on Dumbo now. At Alice Town Christina, we were talking, it's a great time to go on it because it's not nighttime yet, but the lights are going and you can see them so good and it's a little drizzly. This is like su Dumbo in Seattle. What? You're gonna, are you gonna push that on? <gasps> We did it! We. <laughs> We're going up too. Whoa! Look at there's mommy. Woohoo! Down, 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 down. Up, 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 up. Up, 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 up. Down, 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 down. Whoa! Whoa! Up, 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 up. It's an extra special ride for all of our kids because it's everybody's first ride. Yeah. All of the kids. So My first ride ever. <laughs> I don't think I have Luca and Poppy's first ride on film, actual film on camera, um, but I do have uh, our kids and Violet, so I'm going to put those clips in here for nostalgia's sake. I think Sarah's avoiding Epcot because we said that since Sarah was getting the Hollywood Studios one that I was going to get Epcot one, and ever since then she keeps coming to the news and talking about Epcot. Like it's that the part is of the not true. Sarah and I did say you know Dumbo is open air and outside and I didn't say anything <laughs> <laughs> so I'm nervous <laughs> like should we take him on Dumbo we're doing it we're doing something big okay. this one okay oh. we're about to do it <laughs> oh my gosh the castle moon we're walking in was like wait First ride? 
And she was like, ah, congratulations. Right this way, mom and dad. Can you believe it? I, I truly can't. <laughs> I really can't. Let's oh, see this gosh. sleepy kid. Oh, his eyes are open now. Here you oh, go. James, you're on your first ride. Right as nine o'clock hit and the park closes, James Ryan Brookhart. Same first, first. Same first ride as his cousin Violet. Oh my gosh. And Teddy's about to go on his first ride. Dumbo. Oh, look at that. Your brother has officially. Yay! Your brother has officially gone on his first Disney World ride. Yay! Whoa! What's our next ride, guys? Um, on this. Um, I know. There you go. Oh, baby. <gasps> Another really short wait time. The rain is working in our favor tonight. That's what this story is all about. Starkman over now. Alright, the entire Brookhart clan is in a one spaceship. I don't know if we've ever done this. We've not. They're a little big. Uh, will we both get Galactic Hero? Victory is ours! We did it! Lindsay was the pilot. Off one ride. On to the next. During fireworks, baby. Oh yeah. Let's go. Give out a high five. Woohoo! This is the TTA Blue We thought Space Mountain was 15 minutes, but it's it's actually down. And the most refreshing retreat in the galaxy, the coral moons of Pisces 7. You H2 owe it to yourself. Book today. No Jamesy, we're gonna see Space Mountain. It's so, I, it would be so terrifying to, to ride that with the lights on. Was that good? Give a thumbs up. 
Thumbs up. Until they open automatically. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to see the finale from here. Oh, there's some of it. that for a Sunday. Nothing like a 9.30 Baba and a cup of Joffrey's while everybody else goes to Winnie the Pooh. Wow, are you in that house? <laughs> Daisy's quite excited. We are going to go on poo while Daddy gets a coffee and Teddy has a battle. He got off the ride and ran straight to the Pooh Bears. We're on our way out. And we got Mickey, Minnie, and Donald saying goodnight over here. Boys, look. Do you see Mickey and Minnie? <laughs> Who's up there? Hi. <laughs> Welcome home, guys. <laughs> Donald caught it. <laughs> Donald caught your kiss? <laughs> Thank you for visiting the Magic Kingdom. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.